Hello engineers, welcome back to Engineering Design Simplified. In this video series, I will discuss principle of virtual work applied for beams. Today's problem is an overhanging beam with a point load. So here is a beam uh, length from A to B is L and from B to C is A. There is a point load W is acting vertically downwards at point C. So in this problem, we need to find reaction at A, R A and reaction at B, R B using principle of virtual work. Let us see in the coming slides how to solve this problem. To find reaction at B, let us give a virtual displacement of delta C at C. So the beam will assume this position A, B prime and C prime. So here we have triangles A, B, B prime and A, C, C prime. Here the displacement is delta C and here displacement is delta B and here delta A equal to 0. So from these two triangles, we can write delta B by L equal to delta C by A plus L using similar triangles principle. So from this, we can write delta B in terms of delta C as delta B equal to L by A plus L into delta C. Now let us write virtual work equation. So the equation is R A into delta A plus R B into delta B minus W into delta C equal to zero. So the negative sign here is since W is acting vertically downwards and displacement given vertically upwards. So in this equation, delta A equal to zero and delta B we have seen in the previous slide as L by A plus L into delta C. So after substituting this and simplifying, ultimately we get uh, reaction at B, R B equal to W into A plus L by L. Now to find reaction at A, R A, let us give a virtual displacement of delta A at A. Now the beam will assume this position C prime B A prime. So here we have two similar triangles B A A prime B C C prime. So these two triangles are similar and here it is delta A delta B equal to zero at this end uh, displacement is delta C. So from these two triangles we can write delta A by L equal to delta C by a. So delta A in terms of delta C can be written as delta A equal to L by A into delta C. Now let us write virtual work equation. So the equation is R A into delta A plus R B into delta B plus W into delta C equal to zero. So in this equation delta B equal to zero and delta A equal to L by A into delta C that we have seen in the previous slide. So after substituting these two in this equation and simplifying ultimately we get reaction at A, R A equal to minus W A by L. That's all for today's video. If you like this content, please like, share and subscribe. Thanks for watching.